hard to miss it You are so optimistic Thinking you could get like me You ain't really bad at I see I'm clean as new white teeth Hello, good morning everyone It is July 28th And my hair looks a mess, I know But I'm, I'm actually late right now I'm gonna go look at two houses today Because I wanna go I wanna buy a house <laughs> Um, so if I'm going to be honest, I've been filming, oh wait, go lay down, come on, let's go lay down. Um, I filmed yesterday and I kind of want to film today, go lay down, but I just don't know how to like put this. So I don't know if I want to wait until like I actually, like if I'm just documenting, um, me buying a house or what, but I just... I would like to buy a house and I'm going to be recording, obviously, um, the inside and everything. And the first house is a new construction built one. And hold on a second. So it's a new construction. <laughs> and um, so that would be good because it's also a four bedroom house. And it was only $100 more than a house that was built, I think. We said it was in the 70s. So it's a newer construction, bigger and cheaper. So I guess that's probably going to be because of the location might not be good, which is unfortunate. But you can only do so much in this in this city that I'm in. It's not always going to be the best unless you want to pay more. So I'm going to meet you guys there. I need to be fixed. I think that's just brand new. They just added that. You want to walk the area? I don't like the fact. So, I mean, you're going to have to, like, make a, um... Pave it. A paved, yeah, area. This oh. is kind of small. I mean, I guess we can cut down some of the yeah, trees. Yeah, no, we can trim it. And look at that. The wiring. Yeah, no, that's just... That's, yeah, it's literally... That's what would happen. So, we either just take down all the trees? Well, definitely well, we tell them... take down the ones that are on the other side of the fence. Well, yeah. But I'm saying, like, tell them that they have to take fix that, the tree. Um, yeah, I hope so. I wouldn't like to buy it. Lily said you had to come with me to go. Ugh, I like the smell. The smell is better. <laughs> well, the floor is better. Um, kitchen. Ooh, Ooh that's the basement. I will follow you then. I'm scared. I found a person down here. And oh, that's way too. Uh, I'm not going down there. Never mind. You can you can go explore that. Hmm. I was thinking I put all my makeup in there. Oh, dang it, shut. I don't even know what you could do with that. I wish there was more like uh, more windows though. Yes, yeah, a little nice open. You see that? Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm making it up. <laughs> no, okay. it's not attached to the floor. That's not bad. Yeah, I don't know. The water is so huge. Thoughts? Bathroom in here. Cute. Wait, is this two bedroom? Oh, wait, I didn't even go all the way down. Three. Yeah, three bedroom. Closets are uh, really, really small. What's in there? Oh, basement? Yeah. Is it better? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Oh, it's wow. There's still no ceiling. Oh, there is a basement? Yeah, it looks a lot better. Oh, God, I'm so scared to come down here. It's really low, though. Aiden, yeah. you're like a giant. Well, yeah, I'm just talking about that. So where's the washing machine and dryer? Um, what? I was looking at that one. I was like, oh, yeah, that's it. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Like, I'm not sure why there's a question, though. I mean, it's, 
there's no question. And look, this would match our couch so perfectly. It will. The dining the table, you don't even have to condense yep. the table. Whoa. Yep. So he let, so I talked to the agent. Mm -hmm. and he's coming to you from like the editing screen, so this is gonna be a little bit bad quality. But I want to explain a few things because this video was definitely filmed at random times and it was not a flow of events. So this basically took, a like this entire footage is from July to October. So the first clip, I already looked at like three houses before, um, like I did not have any storage so I didn't have like, it would be a few clips here and there looking at different houses, like, mostly photos. So I didn't want to put that into the video. It was kind of, like, irrelevant. So I looked at maybe three houses before I went to look at the one in the first clip. And that was the four-bedroom house. Uh, I lost the footage. I don't know what happened to it on my camera. Um, I might try to look for it. I have, like, different areas. So I might try to look for it because it might be somewhere on my computer. But it doesn't matter. Because you'll see at the end that we did close on a house and it was that four bedroom. And I might hop in a different section to explain more. But like I said, this came from July to October. And we looked at several houses. You can definitely tell in my voice how I'm not like, like this is not it. You can definitely tell how I was not feeling some of these houses we were looking at. But let's let's just just keep on watching oh sorry this next clip this next clip that you're about to watch though is me i guess so this is what happened so we signed like signed an offer for a two-bedroom house and that was the last house that you saw we haven't heard anything from like seller i haven't heard anything from my real estate agent so i was like getting nervous so like essentially essentially i was like manifesting like some result and then I'll come in and explain a little bit more. Just just continue watching. And I have yet to get an email about if I got the house. So if that's concerning. This house still says um, new construction, which means that they still haven't accepted an offer yet. But I put down the purchase price. And so I'm just confused why it's taking so long to get an email stating if I got the house or not. You know what I mean? She sent me a screenshot of what the seller texted her um the house that i was showing the other day was like a blue green house it's the same builder same seller and everything and we applied for that all day we didn't hear back from the seller like we didn't get an acceptance offer and so my mom she was like she was stressing me out she was like um is everything okay so then my real estate agent, she just texted me. She said, um, send me a screenshot of what the seller said. He said, hi, are your buyers still interested in this house? Um, it looks like the other person that did get accepted doesn't qualify for all the criteria, yada, yada, yada. So she texted me. She's like, are you still interested in the house? And I said, yes, because first of all, it is a four bedroom house, two and a half bath. And like the bedrooms feel a lot more spacious. Uh, the other one house, the other house that I was showing you, it was um, two beds, two beds, two baths. And the, the roof is like concave in the bedroom. Um, so that's kind of unfortunate. But um, I was just like, why haven't we heard back? Like I, was, I even looked it up. I was like, when's the time frame of a, like an offer to coming in? And it said 24 to 48 hours. And like some people might even do it like same day, you know? I was like, oh my God. So I was, I was actually kind of getting nervous, but I was like, no, let me keep faith. So the fact that we got a text message talking about the original house that we wanted means we might be getting that one instead. 
and I'm just I'm too turnt about that one. Oh, I got a package. So I just wanted to update that. <laughs> go lay down. Go lay down, Spike. Oh. <laughs> oh, look at the little baby. Okay, so I have to go to work. And I lay down, Spike. And I have a feeling that I'm going to get an answer while I'm at work. Go lay down. On whether um, we were accepted for the house. My only thing is, right, we asked for $175, which I, it's, it's not bad. It's like $5,000 less than um, the asking price. And the only thing is, though, well, they... They were making like a little deal with us with the two bedroom house and they said that they would give us three thousand dollars in closing costs and my question is are they gonna do 175 and give us three thousand dollars in closing costs or what you know what i mean so either way either way i'm just so excited but i just have a feeling like i'm gonna get a i'm gonna get an answer at work so i won't be able to record my reaction but I'm getting a house at freaking 20 years old. That's wild. And it's brand new. Built in 2022. You know what I mean? So. Oh my god. This is just this is so crazy. So you might be a little bit confused. So like I mentioned earlier in my other editing clip. Um, I sent in an offer for the two bedroom house. We haven't heard anything back. And it honestly took like maybe even a week to even hear anything back. So I was so freaking nervous. I was like, oh my gosh, I just ruined my credit score for nothing. I will do a full YouTube video on this as well to get some more clarity on this. But I was just like, oh my gosh. So essentially the seller was trying to make some moves for us to get the four bedroom house that we originally wanted. Um and yeah so that's just me explaining in that like previous clip that we sent an offer but then my real estate agent was like hey like the house is back on the table do you want to like sign an offer and then in this next clip like i said i did not film as good as i should so i apologize um this next clip we went to closing and we signed on the four bedroom house <sighs> I'll do it and I'll do a better explanation video in a few days time. Well, I did not record anything there, but we closed on the house. Oh my god. Okay, so this will be the conclusion of like I think I'm going to attach like all the other houses that we were looking at. Um also, I don't know if I have the footage of the like of the house. So I'm going to do a separate video, like a house tour, but yes, it is my 21st birthday. I bought a house and that's that. Um, also, I got my hair done. <laughs> um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for coming on this journey with me. And I hope you stay tuned for the home tour.